cereal boxes, pizza boxes, shipping boxes, all of those things that seem to stack up in our houses. Eventually we get around to throwing them out. New Center Maine's Hannah Yashivi reports a mill in Maine is taking them and repurposing them. Any of the cardboard, basically. You know, we're probably doing about uh, 15, uh, emptying these uh, dumpsters about 15 times a week. Cardboard, dumpsters of it. Empty paper worker Gary Scott picks up cardboard dropped off by community members at the mill in Old Town. And this is the pile right here, this is all from the community. A significant but small portion of the operation process. But we also bring a lot of cardboard in uh, that we purchase uh, from uh, mostly out of the state of Maine that's kind of coming out of like the, you know, grocery stores, Walmarts, different shopping centers. Then this cardboard gets cleaned up and processed through machines that we were not allowed to film. Once it comes out clean, it gets converted into this dry pulp fiber. About 200 metric tons of unbleached dry pulp is created here every day. That's the weight of about 30 school buses. And then this product now becomes a usable uh, source of fiber for someone to be able to make some other sustainable package, uh, paper and packaging uh, products. Not only is it um, cuts back on the landfill um, waste, um, it also creates good paying local jobs. This new process created 15 jobs. Gary got one of them. He used to work at the Lincoln Mill that closed seven years ago. And I got assigned to this special project. An earth-friendly project made possible by an impact investment firm out of New York. Michael Coringold is the CEO of Enhanced Capital. But what we also love to see is that it has a ripple effect. All the vendors um, that now are doing business with the mill, the, the truckers, the loggers, the rail workers. And helping us keep tons of waste out of landfills and turned into new product. In Old Town, Hannah Yashivi, New Center, Maine. Now, another feature of this patented machine that does all the work is that it requires very little water compared to traditional pulping operations.